butterflies welcome back to my channel welcome back to another daily vlog sorry i'm moving this a little this way <laughs> how are all of you guys doing today i'm doing so good it is such a beautiful morning here actually it's kind of the weather's kind of like i don't know <laughs> hold on let me move this i don't know why it's acting there we go that's a little better <laughs> it's acting a little funky right now but um yeah, the weather's a little, like, cloudy, and uh, it feels like it's going to rain here, but it's not. Then it's choppy with some sun and, like, blue sky, so I don't even know. <laughs> but it's actually nice, though. Like, I actually like it. It's giving me those, like, fall vibes and winter vibes, and I don't know. I think that's why I woke up feeling so good. I already started doing some things I put away. I did laundry the other day, and I didn't put away my towels, so... That's what you've seen me doing in the beginning of this video. Um, and right now, I'm just going to take care of some more house things and stuff like that. Um, hubby's going to be working a little later today. So I'm going to thoroughly do some things. I wanted to work on some things in my kitchen if all goes well. I don't have a whole lot to do, but I did want to clean out the refrigerator. I wanted to refill my ice. I wanted to, um, because I think tomorrow tomorrow or the day after tomorrow i wanted to try to make some blended iced coffee so i'm trying to make like a bunch of ice and stuff like that right now so that's what i'll probably do and then i did want to show you guys that so i'll probably show you that i already had some iced coffee i didn't have any warm coffee this morning i had iced coffee this morning because i figured out that the last couple days that i've been having hot coffee um, I've been feeling like a little more overheated than normal and I'm like that's because I've been drinking a hot coffee so I don't normally do that during this time you know what I mean so anyways yeah just gonna do some little things in the house and I wanted to take you guys along to just hang out with me today and see what we get done around the house I do have some stuff to do though I did want to do some things in my room but I don't know if I'm gonna do that I already cleaned it yesterday and organized a bunch but there is some organization I wanted to do in there my vlogs have been a little bit choppy you guys they've been a little bit like oh because by the time I get to get to my especially the other day when I vlogged um, I had to edit and I I actually have a new editing routine where I can start my vlog at a good time and um, it won't take up much of my day to edit. I'm editing the night before and then I kind of just post early in the morning the next day and then um, that it all works out because then everything is good. My storage won't get used and then I could start a whole new vlog right after. So um, that's my new system and it's going to work. It worked really good this morning for me and I, I used to always do that but I would get so tired and I would just go to bed and try to go to bed early instead of sitting there and editing but yeah. Anyways, enough about that. Let's get started with this day and see where we're at. I got some planning to do today, too. Um, I'm always planning, you guys. I'm always planning. Let me put my hair up real quick, though, girl, because I don't want to, like, I don't want to get overheated today. So my hair is going to be up looking crazy. I took a shower last night, so my hair is super curly and natural. <laughs> but, um... Yeah, let's get started. Let's just get started. I'm going to show you the weather a little bit too, like, you know, so you can kind of, you know, maybe get fall vibes with me. <laughs> but, um, yeah, let's get started with this day. First of all, you guys haven't been in this area with me for quite a while. I haven't really been in the kitchen too much lately, but there is some things that I did want to do organizational-wise in here. So I think I'm probably going to work on that today. I woke up feeling a little bit more like, oh, I can do that. First of all, I did organize this little section here. 
This is what I, oh, hold on a minute. This is what I use this little caddy area for. I gotta put those away though in the baskets behind me. But yeah, so that got organized. I do have to clean in here. I have to clean my floor. So that'll probably get done today as well. But we'll see. I might do that tomorrow. Um, I do have to just clean these little bit of dishes. I haven't really been having dishes because we haven't been really been using the dishes. Um, you're probably like, well, what are you eating? We are actually doing easy microwavable days because of this heat. But when it starts cooling down, mama's getting back in here and she's going to start cooking. <laughs> but, um, yeah, so what I do got to do, though, is I have to clean these counters. We had got some ants the other day. I don't know how we got those ants in here because there's nothing in here. I don't even know. So I got to clean the counter. But I did want to work on this today. Um, I, this is a little shambled, there's the word again. <laughs> um, it got really shambled, so I kind of want to work on this today. I think I'm going to work on this right now. Why is there like a fly in here? Oh my goodness, I haven't been in here and things need some, this, this room needs some attention. <laughs> but yeah, I'm going to go ahead and work on this area right now actually. And then, hold on. See how this area looks a little like it's all over the place. Things aren't organized right. Things aren't, uh, you're probably like, whoa, your overstock is shaking. Well, it's because we've been having a lot of easy days. I haven't really like stocked up on a lot of this stuff. I will stock up probably in like the next month or so. But for now, this is what it looks like. Um, and then I do have to clean this out right here. So I'm going to work on these areas in here right now. And then I'll show you my progress. Um, I was going to refill the jars over there with the, um, with, uh, the, what I need to refill them with. But I think I need to get stuff to refill. The only thing I could refill right now is the rice and beans. But those are actually pretty much full so I'll see about doing that I was going to refill them in the last video but I was like oh, by the time I did what well, got to that I got tired and didn't want to do it <laughs> so I'm going to work on this little area here sorry the lighting is like really there we go and then it's a little dim in here too because of the weather outside so yeah so I wanted to work on this area what I dread showing you hold on oh, okay I just set something down <laughs> okay uh, what I dread showing you guys, but this needs to be cleaned out, like, big time, girl. So, I'm going to be working on this area as well. I also need to come back in here and clean up in here. See all this stuff right here? Some, like, spillage of water and, I don't know, you know, stuff like that. So, I'm going to be working on these areas today a little bit and then maybe a little bit into the next video tomorrow I don't know I'm gonna be working on it. I gotta throw a lot of this away so I'll probably clean that out um, and then see my ice things here I started filling up this one this one's almost full this one was full but I was using it yesterday and then this is for like okay cuz see this little tray right here don't look at my my little thing here needs to be clean but you see this tray right here these are let me show you these little round balls okay and these actually are in these little round things okay and then this is all excess like stuff that you know um ice that breaks up into these pieces here so i use this little container here hold on let me turn that around I use this little container here for those because, you know, that's also ice and I didn't want to waste it. So that's what that is. So I have to do all that and organize all that. <sighs> Girl. <laughs> Back in this beautiful, blessed kitchen <laughs> uh, that I need to work on the little things for right now. Um, I already started working on the little cabinet up here. And um, I'm going to work on, I might not get to the fridge today though, but we'll see. I'm going to try to get to that fridge today. i got a lot of time today where I can do these things, so I'm going to try to get to them. Um, and then I also, the reason why I said some planning too is because like when I'm doing these areas, I'm actually writing out a list of things that I either ran out that I need to re-up on or, you know what I mean? Just, just that kind of stuff pretty much, you know what I mean? So, I've already written down that I need some more sugar and I need some more oatmeal because that's why these jars in front of me are empty. I got a lot of flour, I got a lot of rice and a lot of beans, so those are good. Um, 
I will need to re-up on some other stuff. Uh, and that is why I'm going to be working on, excuse that pot right there. It got a little worn and torn, but it's okay. Whose pots don't get like that, okay? <laughs> don't judge me, judge your man. I'm just kidding. <laughs> but, um, yeah, so I'm going to also go through my stockpile as well and do the same thing. So, yeah, I'm already getting it working. What is it? Really flying here? Bugging the heck out of me. Okay, I'm going to go get this guy and then this fly of a guy. And then I'm going to <laughs> uh, continue working. Hi, first things first, I went ahead and put away the stuff that I told you I needed to do there. And voila, she is organized. Uh, this was like a deep organization right here because I really wanted things to kind of be... Let me the lighting in here i'm sorry um i really wanted things to be super organized so i kind of rearranged a lot of stuff and it looked a lot better i opened up those little ramen cases and stuff and just organized them by you know height and type and then you know just kind of rearranged a little in there i also rearranged in there pushed a lot back so i know how much room i got and what i need to buy i'm also going to come in here in a while and make a list i pretty much know what i need to put in there you guys um but i just wanted to make a list to double check and then i have two baskets down here now they would push those over push these this is a stockpile of chips that we keep in there and then this one's empty for anything else i want to store now here comes here comes something i wanted to show you guys that i had been talking about and anticipating and i figured it out what i wanted to do so da, 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 i have a drink shelf now inside of the kitchen. I went ahead and just utilized this one that I had already had. There was empty shelving and I was like, well, what can I do with it? You know, like, so this is exactly how I wanted. I wanted a skinny shelf, okay? And I wanted to put my drinks on there that we currently are drinking. And then the extra cases that we have, I'll just, well, I don't have extra cases of water right now, but if we do, I'll just kind of store them, you know, I don't know, maybe store them right here until, I know it's clutter, but until I can get them in the shelf. I'm working on moving this stuff here somewhere else, and then I'll have another top shelf to put them on, because I was using this for, like, decor and, like, my envelope to hold my envelopes, but I have that desk, so I think I'm going to move a lot of this over there and then I just have like some things that I had stored on the shelf but it looks better because now all my stockpile stuff is together even the drink stockpile stuff is together so I'm super duper excited about this it looks really good it looks really organized now and I'll just have to clean that back shelf really good back there with all my uh like old spices I'm thinking about getting rid of that and then using that for something else as well um, I was even thinking about using it for, like, since this is the stock area, using it for, like, some stock stuff as well. Maybe to put the ramen in, or I don't know, you know what I mean? Uh, maybe some canned goods. I don't really know, like, the canned goods that don't really have a lot of canned goods. So, I don't know. We'll see about that. But for now, it's going to stay the way it is until I can figure it out. Because I think a lot of those, I don't use any of those spices. I attempted to do, like, a aesthetic thing, but... It didn't work out because the jars actually make your spices go bad. So I can't use any of those spices. So I kind of just left them there for decor. Maybe that right there could be what it could be for. It's just a spice decor because it goes with the kitchen. So because this used to be like a cabinet. I think that was like supposedly the pantry cabinet for uh, this house. But because it's an older house. And I guess people back in the 50s didn't really stock this much <laughs> so that's why they had like that little bit so I just used it for that right now and then any of my little dishes and stuff but it looks good you guys I'm so excited and then I haven't finished that I started it but I haven't finished it so I'm gonna finish that in a little bit but I'm gonna take a little break go grab my cafecito and then I'm gonna show you one other thing this is what I wanted to show you. My drink area is clear. There's no more drinks up here. Uh, as far as like the overstock waters, 
they are now I don't mind that hole <laughs> that I made that hole for the project that I want it for right here uh, which I will talk about another time <laughs> um, but um, yeah so the drinks are not there anymore I do have those down here okay but this one is empty now but remember I told you guys in like a vlog or two ago that they, these are overstock waters for the cafecito station so these won't get touched unless that those need to get refilled um so they're gonna stay there unless like we absolutely need to use these waters we run up excuse me if we absolutely run out like before I can get more um then we will gravitate toward them but i know i'll re i will be restocking that as well to um you know for the cafecito station this area gets used a lot during the holidays right now it's on a pause <laughs> and i'm just trying to kind of you know stock up a little bit for the holidays i will be picking up a lot of holiday stuff though you guys i'm gonna be trying i'm saving right now for the holidays right now that's what i'm doing because the holidays are my jam and yeah don't mind the water bottles and all that and i like to stock up on a lot of holiday stuff for my cafecito station mainly because um i'm always drinking you know cafecito and um i also stock up like a little snack area here like a pastry area like with some bond bread or some donuts that's why i keep that right there and then it's good for like bond and cafecito in the morning so but right now i don't grab any of those sweets because of the ants i wait and i wait and i save and then if we do we eat it up right away <laughs> but um yeah so that's done i'm super excited and now i have an extra basket here that i can use for something else so um, I'm going to leave it here though for right now and then when I get this project going I'll show you what that's going to be uh, but for now this is all done <laughs> and then I took out a basket off of that shelf right there and it's right here now I'm going to use it for my desk area probably to fill up pins or maybe even those little notebooks in there and stuff it was for all my grocery stuff and I figure I do all my grocery stuff here now like my grocery planning I do it here now so I don't need it over there on that shelf and it looks like I might not finish all the kitchen today in this video. Um, I'm trying to get down to uh, finishing the refrigerator so I can wash all those dishes and then um, I can do like I could put all the, I can do that cabinet like a lot more. I started it but then I thought about it I was like I better wait till I'm doing that. So I'm gonna take a breather, drink some more of my cafecito here. Probably have some lunch because it is lunchtime. That took me a while to do that shelf because things were falling and I was procrastinating. But did you see that skinny shelf? That's what I wanted. I wanted something skinny like that in that area. That's what I was talking about. And then later, I'll work on this area right here. Doing the, um, doing that uh, whole, uh, like, movie night shelf slash, like, maybe decor shelf. And then what I'm going to do is move my cleaning cart probably to the washroom now to the laundry room now or i could probably store it somewhere else i do like it right there because it's easy but i could just run in the back and go get it um but we'll see about that <laughs> we'll see what i'm gonna where i'm gonna be at putting that at maybe i'll just kind of like do this watch and uh oh i have the fly water out for those flies <laughs> since this uh it's probably gonna have that shelf because i'm looking for it i'll probably move this right here like that because uh, I do use this like on a daily and then the shelf will go right there uh, until I can get some space in the laundry room to put this and then this will go inside the laundry room. I did forget to mention that a lot of the waters that were inside of here, oh sorry I still got stuff I'm putting away over there as well <laughs> from this morning. <laughs> um, all the waters, that, a lot of the waters that were in there, a lot of the waters too, I put inside my freezer because hubby takes some to work. I like having frozen water throughout the night, so I have to put, I love ice water, especially right now in the hotter months, so I have to keep it inside of the freezer, so that's what I did as well. So a lot of water went in there. I'll kind of show you that a little bit after I clean up in there. <laughs> like freezer and refrigerator are all nice and done and organized and I decluttered got rid of some stuff and I wiped down the whole outside here of the refrigerator here doesn't really need to have pictures um, these are the waters that I told you I stick in here these waters will last in here probably for the rest of the week depending on how many because I usually takes like two a day um, 
so probably until like yeah probably till the end of the week we got like a few more days left here so all these should last because i drink one like every night before bed i also restock so i don't i don't know how long they'll last but yeah those are in here i cleaned off the area here so all that spillage from whatever that was it looked like it was mainly ice cream i think maybe like leaking from the sides of the ice cream containers <laughs> And then I'm going to do the ice in a little while. I'm going to take a breather, though, cause, and then I'll come back and do that. Um, also, I can't do that either because I have another thing that, I'm, that I need to do before I do that. But in here, it's a little bit more organized. And I threw some stuff out. You can see there's some room there now for more things. But we don't need room for more things right now. <sighs> I wiped it down really good. Here is looking... I just, I need to get into those drawers. I'll probably do that in an, another day or maybe in a little while. And then all these, this just stays here. So did that. And then I cleaned this table. I cleaned the counters off really good of all those ants and stuff. And then this is why I didn't want to do the dishes right away because I knew after cleaning the fridge, I was going to have some dishes. I had this, which I need to clean. This is for my iced coffee. The milk container needed to be, that new milk container needed to be clean. All this was already in there. And then this plate was inside the refrigerator. So I need to clean all this. And now when we have leftover food, everything has to get stored inside the refrigerator when we're not eating it or we're going to eat it later. Because the ants, if it sits here or in the microwave, it gets attacked <laughs> by ants. So I'm going to wash these in a little while. I'm going to take a breather again because I was on my knee scrubbing that whole thing uh the whole the whole uh, refrigerator door i was scrubbing it and then i'm gonna come in here wash these and then do this here and then i think i'm pretty much done with the kitchen for now i'm not gonna mop and sweep right now because i have a couple other things that i want to clean in all honesty i'm well yeah i want to clean that microwave and I don't know if I'm going to get to that today. <laughs> if I don't get to it today, it will be done tomorrow. And then I could come in here and mop and sweep the floor. Because I don't want if any of that to fall. I could just sweep it up. And that's why I wait till I'm completely done. But I'm almost done, girl. It's looking so good in here again. And you could tell you probably like, it didn't even look bad. It didn't even look dirty. But when you get a little bit closer to it, you could tell it was dirty. Like, I'm sure you could tell that had a lot of stains earlier. And you could tell this was really, really shambled. There was stuff everywhere. It wasn't as organized. And yeah, <laughs> now I know what we need to go through. <laughs> I've been working very hard. I deserve this. <laughs> but I'm glad I got that done. Uh, it needed to be done. The kitchen's looking a little bit more better. I detailed clean the other day up here. I think I did like a odds and ends. That was all the detail clean for up here. Um, and organized and put away and stuff. And that's basically what I'm doing in there. <laughs> so just, you know, whew, it's just a lot more, like I'm a little sweaty because it gets a little bit more hotter in there than it does out here. Like it feels really good out here in this dining room right now and in the living room. I have the front door open. Let me show you this weather really quickly. It's kind of weird. It's like sunny, there's like, I don't know, girl. But you know what, though? It feels really nice, you know what I mean? I'm going to show you that. I'm, then I'm going to take a breather and drink some of this cafecito. And then I'm going to sit down right there because I need to sit down for a minute and kind of clean, get that uh, basket situated. Um, or that little, what do you call that? Yeah, like a basket organizer. <laughs> I'm going to call it that. I need to get that situated. So I'm going to do that. But... <sighs> Let me show you this weather. It's crazy. It's really nice out here, but look at it. It's sunny right now, but every now and then, like those clouds over there, will clutter and cloud the, they'll cover the, um, sorry, I got traffic that comes by my house a lot right here, uh, that will cover, and it kind of gets a little dark, so like it's really choppy, but look at the clouds over there, like you probably can't tell, but like off camera, it's a little bit more darker than it's giving on camera. So <laughs> I don't really know, but I was gonna clean off this. Well, the porch is already clean, but I have like this stuff. I think I'll go throw this in the trash right now, but I have this stuff to put away. But, oh, those suckers are out here because the ants were attacking the outside of the bag and I had to bring them, they're inside. And I shook them off, they're good. They're still good inside, they didn't get inside, but 
That's why they're out here. But yeah. If it gets darker out here, I'll show you guys more of out here. But to be honest with you, earlier... Sorry, I was on the go right now. Earlier today, a little while ago, it was darker than this. Like the sun wasn't giving like what it's giving right now. It was darker. It was so cloudy and dark right here. And then it's not like a little bit of rain. So I don't really know what's going on. I know that tropical storm's heading this way. I don't know if this is supposed to be part of it or it. But yeah, you could tell in some... Over here, it's like all like sunny. Over there, it's all like cloudy. It's crazy. Hey, butterflies. I just had a random thought. Hold on. This lighting is like going to drive me crazy. So, I just had a thought right now. Um, I remember I mentioned to you a little earlier, probably the other day. I think it was earlier in the vlog or in yesterday's vlog. I'm not really sure that where I, when I clean an area or I go and I organize an area like for like for an example like my I was gonna say my shopping cart <laughs> my uh hold on this lighting is driving me nuts girl there we go it's a little better okay so um like for for an example the cleaning cart and the stockpile shelf when I organize something okay I like to make I like to go and make a list but what I'm gonna like for a re-up or whatever but I think what I'm going to do instead, this is my thought, I think what I'm going to do instead is I'm going to do everything, do all the areas, and then, because it kind of gets a little overwhelming to because then I stop and I want to write and plan, and then I don't get up for a while. <laughs> I'm going to be real, I don't get up for a little bit. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do all the areas that I need to do, and then I'm going to go back to the areas that I cleaned and I organized, and I'm just going to kind of go through it like, it's almost like checking your inventory, but this is my household inventory, <laughs> you know what I mean? Um, but, like, I'm even grateful I could even do that, but, you know, I don't do it right away, I just take a little paper and mental note that I need to do that and, and will do that for when it comes time to, for me to actually be able to get the stuff that I need to refill those areas so that is my thought and I just wanted to mention that because um, I know I, I that's usually how I do it and I wanted to mention that if you guys didn't know and you hear me talking about it that's usually what I do is I I would normally go through all the areas and write a list of some things that I ran out of from those areas and put it to the side for another time when I can purchase those things for, the, for those areas but in all honesty I think I'm gonna organize all the areas do what I need to do and then go back to them and then go through them thoroughly and sit there and take my time and go through them because the last time I did that I realized that the whole point of this is because I realized the last time I messed up and I forgot a lot of stuff but because I was doing double I was tired on top I was tired from doing double because I was cleaning the area then going back and getting my notepad and I was writing things and I was like kind of tired and winded so I was like you know what I, I need to do it in a different system so that's just my thought <laughs> I'm not going to talk anymore I just wanted to share that with you because I know I talk about it in between when I'm doing things so yeah so get yourself a system girl because sometimes having a system and a routine and planning out ahead and you know what I mean or even after you know like writing you know doing what you need to write down what you need like, you know, doing it this way, I think it's, it's the best way. It's the best way for me, especially, like, for me, I have, like, cleaning and organization and planning OCD, and I think I have ADHD because, in all honesty, when I start a project, I don't know if that can, that's considered part of that. I heard it is, but I'm not sure. I'm not an expert or anything on that, but I heard that when you start a project and then you leave a project and you go start a new project and you got that other project, like, there, I do that sometimes. You know what I mean? You could tell in my vlogs and my videos that they're all over the place like that. And I'm trying to get better about it, but it's very hard because I I do that. I, I think I get so overly, overwhelmingly excited to take care of these areas that I just jump, 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 jump. One, one, the other, one, the other. And then by the time I come back, it's like a big old mess. You know what I mean? <laughs> so... Yeah, that's what I did a little earlier when I realized when I showed you guys my towel situation because I had started folding them. I showed my clip of I did that. They were just sitting here. I didn't finish it, and I jumped to the next project with you guys. So, 
ay, 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 my brain. <laughs> but anyways, I wanted to share that with you. I will chat with you guys in a little while. Butterfly, I just got done doing a little bit of some planning. I have more to do um, and a little bit more of like my list making to do. But I went ahead and I switched out that little uh, pin thing for this one. And I put my little notepads in this one and all the pins and pencils that I use to plan and stuff. And then there's my planning uh, clipboard. I I'm going to keep it down there from now on. And then um, can you guys believe, though, that I was able to switch out my... Um, to do a uh, notepad it's got it all filled up so this is it right here i'm just gonna toss it throw it away because i'm all done with it but the other little um container that i had my pins there you guys seen from time to time it was like a little square one this is what i ended up doing with it so i had a glass uh, container for uh, my straws I switched that out it was a little like a I think it was like a spaghetti jar <laughs> but I switched it out for this one this is the container I was telling you about and I like this one so much better because there's so much more room in there and then if I wanted to I could even add some more you know uh, I've seen some really cute butterfly ones online that were clear like this and hold on, let me get the light on. There we go. They were clear like this, and they have little clear butterflies at the top. I really would love to get some of those in the future here. But, um, yeah, I think it looks a lot more better. It looks a little bit more, I didn't like that round vibe of that one. This one looked really nice, though. It looks a lot better. So, yeah, so, and it fits more, like I was saying. So, I'm actually super excited about that. <laughs> so, um, yeah, so I was able to put it over here. So it looks good, though. I think it does. I don't know, you know, what you guys would think. And then there's a cup, one of these cups that belong right here. That's why it's empty and it looks like that, that are in the sink um, that I need to wash. I still need to wash some dishes. I still need to put, I have a cup, that's a of cups that belong up there. And then I have that one that belongs there. But I think it looks so much more better and more functional. And, hey... You know, I, this is why I do the things I do in the house, because to be honest with you, when I, I this is how I say it, like when, um, like I, this is why I say that you could utilize everything in your house, just make sure you thoroughly take your time and you really think and you really go through your stuff and when one thing is not being used it could be used for something else that's my point and um you know just like the the um the drink shelf that got used for that and i had already had it i just needed to think it up in here <laughs> and the same thing with that because i was also going to purchase a different thing like that for that because i didn't like the last one i didn't like how it looked you know what i mean plus it, they were getting shoved and they, none of them really fit and i couldn't fit more if i needed more so now i have that and then the other thing got done so you've seen i utilized things that i had already had i didn't even need to spend any money buy new things to do you know organizational things which with which that makes me so happy guys <laughs> because I was already like thinking oh I gotta buy a new shelf for that <sighs> for the drinks in there I need I wanted to I had a lot of this stuff like actually in this notebook that I write in I plan out like future goals and stuff of some things that I want to pick up for the house and now I can honestly check off those two things with what I already had so that is super awesome Yay me, I pat myself on the back because <laughs> I just, I guess I needed some rest so I can think and uh, think clearly of what I needed, uh, what I already had. So, and everything looks so good, so I'm happy with it. I'm going to go do those dishes because I haven't done them and I don't think I'm going to get to my shelf up on top. I started it, but I didn't finish it. I'll probably finish it tomorrow because, uh, not because I'm doing this little stuff. This is something I wanted to do to put everything away. But I need to get those dishes done and they need time to dry. If I get them dry, because I dry them now with a rag because the um, ants, they will attack even your clean dishes. It's unbelievable. <laughs> but um, so if I can get those dry, I will go back to doing 
that shelf. I honestly want to get that done today because I have plans for other things for the next video for me to do with you guys. And I don't want to take any more time doing that because I've been saying it for a while. <laughs> that When it comes to that shelf, it takes me a little bit more time because to get up and down, I'll probably just get it done. You know what I mean? So I'm going to try to knock this out and I will chat with you guys in a little while. <laughs> Five dishes are all done. Sink is clean. I even cleaned the table because I did use that mat to clean the dishes and put them on there to dry. But I cleaned that up and dried all the dishes and put them all the way. I semi got this a little organized. I got to do a little bit more up there. I'll do that tomorrow. But I got all the clean dishes up there. I got to like unshamble this corner and kind of rearrange that a little but and then put this back in here but other than that it looks way better than it did counters are clean i gotta just put this somewhere i'll probably because uh, this used to go down in there but since i have that full i have to relocate this so i might just relocate it like somewhere right here for right now but it's gonna stay on the table for right now um, and then I just cleaned these and left them in here till these get refilled. This is my ice cafecito one. I had to clean it out real good. And this is for the milk. I got to refill the milk, but I needed to clean the container because it stunk from the last milk that kind of expired a little bit. That was like about maybe this much of it that got expired and I needed to clean it. So went ahead and did that. So I'll refill those probably tomorrow morning or probably later before uh later like in a little while after i uh, relax but yeah i'm all done in here guys looks good i'm done tomorrow i'll hit the floor and then uh kitchen is clean and see i put back that other glass and now it looks complete so this whole area everything is nice and clean and put back together and then i just feel better when all these are clean and put back together. Unfortunately, this one, I remember a while back I went to, it broke. Can you see that? I'm so sad. The other one didn't break. But what's weird is that they're made for cafecito, right? Hot cafecito. But when I put hot cafecito in that cup, it shattered. So I couldn't use it and I couldn't take them back. So I kind of just left it up here as like a, how do you say, like a, you know how like when you have like a vintage table that's all like rusted and uh it's like that's like the rusted feel <laughs> i just left it there for that and plus it fills in that corner um when you turn it around you can't really tell it's like so broken but nobody really cares till i can replace them later and then i'll probably just throw them away or keep them well not throw that one away keep this one and just use it for cool drinks <laughs> Because this one's still in good shape. Uh, I got these ones at, um, oh, I think it's Bed Bath & Beyond around my birthday back in January. And um, that's what happened to them. <laughs> so, yeah. <laughs> and then this one has a chip too, but that's because I used it a lot. But these are still usable. You still can put drinks in them. And I don't know why I have gaps in those. But I got to clean this shelf out too. So I'll probably do that next time too. But yeah, I wanted to show you that it's all complete. So Galfacito isn't complete unless the whole thing is nice and clean and put back together like this. It's out of place and it's going to bug me. <laughs> it usually goes there. And you can see it looks a little bit more even. I put it there because I was vlogging and leaning it, you against it. But okay, girl, I'm done. House is clean. It looks good. That area looks good for today. This here is going to dry. This is where the clean dishes. And I reused this up to like maybe, I want to say four to six times before I wash it. Because you're putting clean dishes, clean water. So, you know, you just want to wash it just in case like, you know, there's like maybe it starts to get like a mildewy smell. Then that's when you know to start washing them. But this has been working so well for me. And it also pushes me to dry my dishes and actually put them away because I would just leave them on the counter. During the winter time, I can leave them on the counter though. But during the summer, I'm probably going to... It pushes me because of the ants to put them away. But in all honesty, during the winter, I'll probably do the same method because the kitchen looks clean. when It looks good when everything is clean and put away. So, yeah, guys, I'm all done. Living room looks good. I'm going to chill right there on that couch right there and get some air, probably watch a movie, and then uh, enjoy this. 
I don't know if you guys can tell, but it's a little gloomy outside. <laughs> this gloominess. But, yeah, girl, I'm done. I also forgot to mention that, see this rag right here? This rag is what I dried the dishes for, uh, with. Dried the dishes with. <laughs> and I didn't wipe nothing else. The counters, nothing. And what I'll usually do with it is I'll hang it on the, uh, I know you're probably like, this is totally unsanitary, but not really because it doesn't smell. They're to dry your dishes, and then I let it air dry, and then I'll dry some more dishes. I'll air dry it on the table like I have that little mat. But the only thing about this is that I only get, like, two uses out of it, and then I gotta wash it because this gets, like, that mildewy smell after a while. Um, actually, I don't think I'm gonna do that anymore. I think I'm just gonna talk to the laundry thing after I'm done it's just because it's still like most of it is still dry and uh, most of it is still very uh, clean so I could probably get like one uh, like one more day use out of it uh, one more use out of it put it that way and then um, it should be good so I just wanted to mention that I know it saves me on laundry soap and then not only that like it does not really that dirty we're not getting sick or anything like that because they're still really clean it's just drying water as long as you don't do it for more than maybe a day for the rag more than like a day if it starts to smell after that day then it's time to toss it in the laundry because you don't want to get that mildewy smell or or anything like that because you will get sick so just you know it's just a little, well, look at my hair. <laughs> it's just a little tip I do just to kind of, I mean, so I don't, it's not wasteful. Because I don't like to waste anything, you know what I mean? So I try my hardest to just do it till I can't do it no more. <laughs> so, but anyway, I'm going to relax. I'm probably going to eat some lunch here in a minute. And then, because I really didn't eat anything today. I didn't even eat breakfast today, guys. I kind of skipped over breakfast. Well, I had a banana yeah, I had a banana, so that counts as breakfast. <laughs> so I'm going to go eat something, relax, and then I'll probably update you guys later. I might come back on here just to end the vlog because I don't really have anything else going on today. We are going to be doing church today, online today here. Uh, during the weekday, we don't go to the church because of hubby's work schedule. And then, like, uh, if, if he has a better work schedule, then we'll, we'll make it out there and stuff like that on Wednesday. But, uh, during the middle of the week. But, um, on Sunday is the day we actually go out to the church. So, um, yeah. So today we are watching church here today. And that's all I got left to do today. Um... I was going to go clean and organize my room with you guys, but I think I'm not going to... I told you I wasn't going to really show my room too much anymore. Uh, but I am going to show you, like, a little bit of the organization that I do with my vanity and my makeup area. So, yeah. I'm not going to do that today, though. I'm tired. I think I just need to relax and part my day because when I don't part my days and overwhelm myself and keep going, you guys know how I am I get so tired you won't see me for a day or two and I don't like to do that you know what I mean I like to keep vlogging even if I have like a down day vlog where I'm not doing anything in the vlog but just talking to you guys and planning with you guys maybe showing you the areas that I do want to organize and gonna get to I like doing those kind of videos too because then I am still putting up content but I'm getting my rest at the same time so yeah all right guys peace for now I will talk to you later. <laughs>
it's like. I'm actually going to go ahead and end the vlog right here. Hope you found its way home. Uh, I just enjoyed that peaceful, like, oh, moment. You know what I mean? I needed that. I, I read some more, and I just wanted to take that time with the Lord and just have a peaceful moment. I'm hot. I got a little hot, so I closed all my windows. You can see all my curtains are closed except for the one that's right here because I needed the light to talk to you guys and then I'll go ahead and close it but I'm gonna end the vlog here hubby's on his way home we're just gonna probably relax get dinner going pretty soon and probably just watch some movies and then that's it for the day so I'm gonna end the vlog here uh just cut oh actually we're not gonna just watch movies I'm sorry lord forgive me we do have church tonight so I'm gonna um watch church tonight and then, um, then we'll probably, well, we're going to relax right now because church doesn't start till way later. So, yeah, we will watch some movies. And then when church starts, we'll go ahead and watch church. And then after that, I think I'm going to hit the hay and go to sleep because I'm trying to train my body to go to bed a lot earlier and to actually uh, wake up a lot earlier. I get a lot more done that way. Um, I did a lot better today than I did the last few days. So, um, sorry, got, got a text. I don't know what that was, but yeah. So if you made it to the end of this vlog, I'm so hot. You see this? I'm also going to take a little shower right now too. Uh, went after hubby gets home and stuff like that so I could open the door and get everything situated for him. I'm also making him something to eat right now. So with that being said, thank you guys so much for watching. If you made it to the end of the vlog, don't forget to love you guys so very much. And you will see me in the next, well, you'll see me soon. <laughs> Bye guys. Guys, the vlog has ended, but I wanted to show you how cloudy it got. Hubby came out here to get the mail. Look, it's... Oh, wait, hold on. Sprinkling a little, and then look at how cloudy it got. It looks... I don't know if somebody's doing something over there, but look how cloudy it got. It got, like... I'm out here in my PJs already. I wasn't gonna vlog this, but look at it. It got cloudy out here, and he said it was raining when he came out to get the mail, because I didn't come out here to get it earlier. I forgot. <laughs> But look at it, it's so cloudy. I thought it was going to be sticky. It is sprinkling a little. I can see it sprinkling. Well, it'll be good for the grass and all. My dog barking, of course. But, oh, yeah, look at it. There's sprinkles. It's sprinkling like heavier, babe. But, yeah, it's like these big old thick sprinkles. But... Look at that dark cloud over there. Like, it got worse. It kind of feels... Oh, you can hear it. Can you hear it coming down? Can you guys hear the rain coming down? It's crazy. Like, this is like, I think, the tropical storm they're talking about. You could tell because the car has all the big drops. But, yeah, like, that's actually pretty crazy. This is the tropical storm we were supposed to get. It's kind of warm out here when it gets tropical stormy like this and it's raining right now look at it's raining can you guys see it let me know if you guys can see it yeah it's raining or sprinkling like big sprinkles see but when it gets like this it gets super warm and sticky so and somebody put a refrigerator over there i don't know why <laughs> but look at the clouds over there i'm in my pj i don't want to be out here too long <laughs> but um yeah, because we're just relaxing right now, waiting for church to start in like an hour. And he came out to check the mail for me because I didn't do it earlier. And he's like, it's sprinkling and it got cloudy and it's dark in the house. So, but yeah, okay, I'm going in the house because, <laughs> or yeah. But yeah, I just wanted to show you that. Look, at, it's getting like a lot worse. If it starts coming down, I'll try to get it. Well, it is coming down more. Can you guys hear it? Oh, it's really coming down now. I'm still out here, but I had to pause it for a minute. I don't want anybody to see me in my pajamas, but who cares? Look at it's really coming down now. Well, this rain might be good for the grass. Can you hear it? It's weird because it's like the clouds are like really choppy. But oh look, you can see it coming down even more over here. Oh, it's coming. Well, good thing I didn't water today. <laughs>
that's pretty cool but all right girl i'm probably gonna go inside but our car's getting a car wash and <laughs> yeah so that thick cloud there i heard it's supposed to get a little bit more intense but i'm not sure if this big cloud is the intenseness or if it's gonna be even more intense oh my gosh i'm getting fall vibes from this weather even though it's kind of warm <laughs> but the grass is getting it's more than it needs okay guys Wait, I was about to go inside, but do you guys see this? I don't know what that is. Is that a bird? It looks like a bird, but then it looks like something else. I don't know what that is. It might be a bird. It's gotta be a bird. Oh yeah, it is a bird, but the bird is like... Hey love, come look at this bird! I think it's not, I don't know if it's a pigeon, but the bird is like opening its wings and it looks also like a, um, like, um, oh yeah, it is a bird, but, hey, somebody's parrot got it, somebody's parrot. That's a parrot, a white parrot. That's why it looks different and it's just chilling there. That's actually kind of crazy and... That is crazy. Anyways, I just wanted to show you that. But he's chilling in the rain. He's enjoying this weather just like I am. <laughs> oh, look. It's getting a little stickier now that I'm out here. But look, you can see the raindrops on top of the car right there. Can you see them? See how it's coming down? <laughs> okay, guys. Just wanted to show you.